Um, well, in just a few hours from now, a powerful hurricane is expected to strike the Papa Hanau Makuakea Marine National Monument. It's something that we've been keeping an eye on for quite some time now. And our chief meteorologist, Sherry Shima, joins us now live with the update. Sherry. Hey, you know, Steph, luckily the Coast Guard evacuated anyone in the area with the range, within the range of Hurricane Neki, and Neki continues to strengthen. The winds now at 100 miles per hour are sustained. The good news is at this hour, it looks like it's undergoing some upper level shear. So the winds right now, 100 miles per hour, the forward motion has slowed a bit. And that's problematic if anyone is on any of these smaller islands. But luckily, everyone has been evacuated because these islands will be battered for an extended period of time because of the slow forward motion. I'm going to set this loop in motion here so you can see exactly what's happening. Right now, all we will see will be the serious blow off here. Those tall top clouds, the upper level winds sort of shearing off all of these high clouds and bringing them up over the northern end of the island chain. A sure sign that this system will start to weaken. In fact, as we take a look here at the forecast track, the forecast track shows it as a hurricane probably for the next 24 to 48 hours and then it will weaken to a tropical storm and as that's the reason why is because as it heads farther north it's moving up into cooler water. Now, we definitely dodged a bullet on this one. It's pretty close. It's about 500 miles sitting off to the west of us. But it, if it had wobbled in any way in our neighborhood, it would definitely change our island weather. If it was not a, a hurricane or a tropical storm, it is still a good pool of moisture. And that's what we really need to emphasize for people to be prepared for the hurricane season. Now that we have El Nino in place, we could see storm systems continuing beyond the end of the hurricane season which is November, so it's there we could see some other storms flaring up. I'll have more on our island weather. It's going to be muggy as we head into a little Friday and the week, and I'll have more on that coming up a little later. Alrighty, thank you, Sherry. There is a happy ending tonight.